Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. The world can be a very scary place. Villains can be larger than life. And almost impossible to defeat. The stress of saving the world can turn even the best of friends against each other. And not everyone will be on your side. Some will try to take advantage of your kindness. But a true hero will know exactly what to do. And will inspire others to do the same. But the scariest thing of all even for the bravest hero? His discovering the villain is much closer than you think. is this? Uh, where's my stuff? The gauntlet! I hope Petra's okay wearing it. Gotta get back, find the admin, find my friends. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Ahem, ahem. Throat clearing sound. The guest will kindly follow the orange line on the floor to the check in zone. zone. Yeah, I heard you. a reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. So the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance. Including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. Must be some sort of mistake. I don't belong here. But the admin sent you here. The admin doesn't make mistakes, so never accuse him of doing so. Never! Y you know he's not here right now, right? You never know. What about my friends? I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. Yeah, you have zero idea what you're saying. Mind that attitude. 
Jesse. And if your friends are anything like you, they'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick. I have a another guest on my manifest. Male, grizzled beard. Hair is described as majestic. Long, long list of aliases hey, distract here. Distract him. Yeah, that's Jack. Oh, Jesse, thank goodness I found you. This I place know. is... let's get out of here. Wait, you can't, it's too dangerous. Stop them, associates! Oh, I can't believe what a mess we're in. And all because I didn't realize Foss was actually the admin. Oh, what a mess. Manipulated, shammed. Don't give up yet, though, okay? You still got me, Nurm, Petra. Yeah. And now the admin has Petra, too. I... I don't know how we're gonna get out of this one. Hey, sound the alarm! We don't stand a chance without weapons. Can we run! Where? Wherever they aren't. Stop them! Don't let them reach the burrows!
minutes and already apprehended in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just... That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. And bring that one to my office. Now. Close the door, would you? Do as you're told. Go on. Uh, sure. Obedient. Good. You and your band of misfits may have hope yet. Band of misfits? Oh, let me show you. Radar! Nerm! You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself, and your punch-happy friend down there. And... And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well behaved. Your friend, with the glasses, is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. So long as you don't hurt my friends, I'll be as well behaved as you want. Oh, good. Good. Show me. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy, glasses. Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. No, 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 this place is filthy! Ah, uh, so disorganized! Ah, making me crazy! Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! I was so... I was so worried! Radar, stop struggling, okay? We need to be obedient and listen to the nice warden here. Wait, what? Jesse? I'm confused. Meet the Iron Breath Taker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. <gasps> Be obedient. Be obedient. <laughs> now, I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Go on and show me how well behaved you are. Join the good guys. Work for me as an associate and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Don't do it, Jesse! What's it gonna be? Okay, I'll do it, just stop! Oh, that's so great to hear. Hi! That was so dark. Easy, easy there. Radar, was it? You just had quite the harrowing experience. But don't worry. Our newest guard, er, associate, will be walking you out. Jesse, no. I don't know how much more of this I can take. <laughs> don't look at me like that. I did this for you, Radar. I'm trying to protect you. But, no. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Stella, what are. How. Well, I appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. 
I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Ah, you two know each other? <laughs> oh, yes. Our bitter rivalry goes way back. Yeah, this place really suits you, Stella. It's cruel, uncomfortable, and nobody likes it. Oh, you're letting your jealousy get the better of you, Jesse. Pity. Watch out for this one, Warden. Jesse plus anything equals trouble. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I've barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe readjust your concerns. There are bigger silver fish to fry than... than... friends. If you're the boss, then I'm loyal to you. Excellent. Just what I needed to hear. What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange, Jesse. Let's go, rival! That's right! Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom! Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Show him around, would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? You have to watch your back with her. She's ruthless. Ta-ta, Jesse. I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. <sighs> you okay, Radar? Wish I was. I need something to eat. Get my strength back. You're in the right place. Guests make mushroom stew here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. There's one! Mushroom! I'm gonna starve. Waste away. You don't have anything in your inventory? You're usually so well prepared. Usually. Only I showed up here with no food, no goods, no nothing. Like everybody else. I saw Jack earlier. He might know what to do. So fighting over a tiny handful of mushrooms is the only way they can eat? Mm, mm, yep. Mm, mm, mm. Do guards get cookies? <sighs> okay, look. I thought you knew. The guards have a delicate supply of ingredients, none of which are approved by the warden. These cocoa beans. I don't have any wheat for you, but I can tell you who does. That pile of gruesome can set you up with the wheat. He's my source. Okay, I should be able to reason with the guy. Oh, no. He's absolutely unreasonable. You're gonna have to remind him that you're an associate and he's a guest. Hey, are you okay, buddy? Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll be fine. Just a little hungry, that's all. You best not be looking at me. So, uh, I hear you might have some wheat? I need two of them. I don't know who you've been talking to, but it ain't true. 
Wheat is considered contraband in this facility, and I am nothing if not a stickler for the rules. Cut the slime, guest. Hand over the wheat before I make things difficult for you. Oh, wow. Here for all of five minutes, and now you're gonna push me around. Ugh. You better remember this. I want special treatment from now on. Yeah, yeah. Hey, come here. Wheat and cocoa beans. All yours, Jesse. No way! I've been down here for too long. I can't stand another second! Whoa! Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hung- Ah, give me that. I'm so sorry. So sorry. I'm just so hungry. Uh, <clears throat> hello? What's going on in here? Jesse, I expect far better from my associates than this. One cookie's not that big of a deal. One cookie's not that big of a deal. And just who does this contraband belong to, hmm? Whew. <laughs> You all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine Institute. So who does this belong to? You might as well just come out and tell me. That guy attacked me with it! Hmm. What refreshing honesty. More like what a refreshing lie, you mean! You rotten snitch! You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... No! Not the zombie mind! Not the zombie bites! Yes. Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. Well done, associate. You've successfully apprehended your first contraband. Keep up the good work. At least now I can make a cookie for radar. Oh, hey there, guard friend. You just caught me putting a happy little finishing touches on my happy little painting here. What, uh, what you painting? I'd so love to paint a happy little mushroom, but none ever stick around long enough for me to paint. I know that you guards don't usually help little old me, but could you build me a happy little mushroom to paint? Here's some wonderful dirt for you to use. If it's not too much trouble after all. Hmm. just that is just lovely thank you ever ever so much please you must share your thoughts on my work so far don't you hold back now honesty's the best policy oh my gosh it's great it's the uh chiaroscuro is just impeccable truly so happy you like it and now i like you You'll be spared when the bad thoughts come. You're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential 
and you just may become the ultimate champion! Eat this. Get your strength back. Thanks, Jesse. I really appreciate... Uh, yeah, sure, thanks, whatever. Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean, Hello, this is prison. Admin here, so from now on... Being so close to finding a suitable champion, the spot remains open to I'm all. prison, Radar. I'm gonna get my own see. mushrooms. Just make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Break whatever rules I feel like. Hey, that's the spirit, Radar. You look awesome. Really? Thanks. Now, get out of here, guard. It's time for Prison Radar to show this world what he's made of. Okay, whatever, you know who this is. I can't believe That's that right! Come at me, dude! A great thing. What's going prisoner on? Prisoner X has escaped! I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped! All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. <laughs> Think that's their cute way of saying sell. Yep, you should get in one too. You haven't had your Protocol X training yet. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder, Prisoner X. I hope you're learning Other inmates were talking about her. Champion. Something of an infamous escape artist. Rumor has it she even knows the way through that maze. Most people have never even seen her, the Keeper locked up, so deep. But everyone's heard of her. And man, do they talk about her. It sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Agreed. Someone with that kind of knowledge could be very useful. But where is she exactly? She's apparently locked up on the deepest, darkest level of this place. Cell Block X. Uh, detecting a theme with the names. Yeah, they found their groove and they're sticking with it. We need to get to Cell Block X. That warden seems to have taken a shine to you. Might not be a bad idea to work your way up. Get on his good side. Could be useful. Or a disaster. But hey, only one way to find out, right? Hmm, the warden does seem to like me. Working the joint to our benefit. Prison radar approves. Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up? I'm gonna find a way to get us to cell block X. Sounds good. While you do that, I'm gonna study this place. Before we're through, I'll know it like the back of my hand. But how to get promoted? That Oxblood guy sure looks suspicious. If I can catch him doing something against the rules, maybe I can get promoted. Nice! Now we're on to something. Now the question is, what do they do? Starting to get the feeling these wool blocks are hiding something interesting. Ah. Let's 
see what I can do with this. I think there's another room back there. Okay, time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. Okay, looks like the buttons move the blocks. I did it! Yes! Oops. Now, if only someone had been around to see me being this impressive. Hmm. Hmm. A mushroom? What the heck are you doing here? Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Ah! Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor. How about you explain what you're doing? I'm questioning someone who's about to lose a lot of teeth if they don't mind their tune. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Did I hear mooing? Oh, come on! Excellent work, new associate. You see, this is how you get promoted. Work your way up. But first, to maintain order. This creature cannot be allowed to undo the balance of the mushroom. Shear it, uh, would you, Jesse? But then it'll be... An ordinary cow. Yes, you know, bringing back the balance of the mushroom. Thought that was obvious. What? No! Fine, I'll do it. No. I can't watch. Jeff, you still recognize me right, buddy? <laughs> Jeff! Jeff! <laughs> Jeff! <laughs> that wasn't so hard, now was it? As for you, Jesse, it's clear you are ready to advance to bigger and better things. You've been promoted to the lower levels. The zombie mines. I get to be your boss now, Jesse. Aren't you the luckiest associate of all? Now get a move on. We don't have all day. Zombie minds, Jesse. Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is... It's gross. I, I get it, but why? It's all part of the admin's plan. I, um, you know, I think. To toughen people up. So if it makes the admin happy, then... Let's make him happy! I can't believe you're actually behind the admin in all this, that you actually believe in him! You're just jealous that I'm in good with him and you got tossed into prison. Who knows, maybe if you work hard enough, someday he'll give you a job, I don't know, cleaning up Luna's climate control llama house. <sighs> Though I suppose, now that we're colleagues at all, I shouldn't leave you completely in the dark. Our job is to supervise the guests as they deal with the endless zombie hordes. Even you couldn't mess this up. Eh, maybe I should knock on wood. 
Makes sense. We are guards, after all. That's the spirit. I may have the superior outfit, general demeanor, hairstyle, and sense of modesty, but yes, we are both still guards. This may not be my dream destination, but at least I'm better off than her. Her who? Prisoner X? You must have heard that alarm before. She was recaptured, but not before taking out a lot of guards. Don't get any ideas, though. Only the Warden's allowed to see her. Now, if you'll excuse me, Luna and I are off to prove why we're the best associates. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall? Not sure why, but man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. some fresh flesh wow you really like that stuff huh nah. oh i love it high in protein high in flavor maybe just a little bit poisonous sometimes but you only live once you sure you don't want some honey to go around it what the heck sure you won't regret it Are you being such a brat, Luna? Come on! Ow! Luna, stop that! I am hitting my llama limit, Luna! Knock it off! Aw, oh, poor powerless Stella. Can't handle her, huh? What? No, 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 no. She's just tired, that's all. Don't you have some guests to punch or something? bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. You know how certain things are your business? Yeah, this ain't one of them. Well then, someone is salty. Hmm, so that redstone leads to this door. I can bypass the redstone circuit. I can open the door. 
What happened? What are you guys doing down here? We couldn't leave you by your lonesome, so we cooked up some trouble and got ourselves sent down too. We're in this together. That's pretty dangerous. Perhaps, but a friend who abandons a friend is no friend. And I am a friend, friend. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Jesse! No fraternizing with the guests. Well, there is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. Ah, oh, Stella. Jesse, you can't keep socializing with your guest friends over there. It's bad form. Gross. Yeah, uh, about that. I, uh... Need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. Why do you care? Just help me out, for, uh, old time's sake. If it's gonna risk my future as the admin's partner, I care quite a bit. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. He's just using you. How can you not see that? No, uh, it's, uh, mutual. We're, you know, using each other, I think. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Um, you know, and power, and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. They will be just, oh yeah, who am I kidding? I've done so much for them in the past, I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look, maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. Uh, sure, Stella, we'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Okay, let's do this. Incoming! Prepare yourself! Stay 
close to me, okay? Guys? Petra! It's Jesse. Why am I not surprised? Admin? The warden told me you were zooming up the associate ladder. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? I don't know if you're dense or what, but working somewhere usually means you don't do things to actively destroy where you work. H hang on, Admin. It it's just a misunderstanding. L let's just talk this out. Misunderstandings? Oh, we are way past misunderstandings. Way past. <laughs> Admin! Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I I'm just, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. No, no, not that. Your star guard, Jesse is nothing but a saboteur. You were my greatest hope. You were moving up the ranks, and now you've ruined me. I thought you were following in my footsteps. Yeah, sorry about that, Warden, but you kind of work for a terrible person. He doesn't deserve an apology, Jesse. Oh, for the love of... Enough! How truly you disappoint me. for you, and you, and you, and especially you. And as for you, I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty, to prove your worth as my champion. Jesse? Well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. No! I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The no! highest of hopes. No! You could have been my champion. You gave it all up. shot at this. I'm gonna go to the admin, and then we'll both attack him. Just trust me on this one. You're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh-oh. Oh, all I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about... Prisoner X, what about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. Guess I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Do you even listen to yourself when you talk? That made zero sense. To you, maybe. But I don't care what you think. <sighs> I'm going to have loads of friends soon, after all. Everyone loves Jesse, right? No. <gasps> no way. You coming? Your back, Jesse.
Cassie. Trust me. I take care of Luna for me. Coming, darling admin! Stella is just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. <laughs> He's gone. Jesse, we gotta stop him. Oh, Petra. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. What? No. You have nothing to apologize for. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. <sighs> I'm so glad you're all right, Petra. Hmm. Yeah, that was... That was pretty bad. After he took me away, I, I was in this weird place. Time and everything was so strange. I felt like I'd been there forever, and I started to worry you'd given up on me. Hey! Hey, I'm just glad you're back now. That's what's important, right? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. I saw Beacon Town, Jesse. They were all worried about you. No one knew where you were, or if you were alive. I'm sure the admin's heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot! It's freaking messed up, yo! I don't care about who's wearing my face, I just want to make sure Beacon Town is safe. We made it! Wow. Some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. Huh. Uh. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. All we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Mm. Come on, I think we can make that jump. Oh. You're up next, Nerm. Oh. Okay, now you, Loon. Seriously, how do you do that? Last jump! Jesse, you must be Prisoner X. <sighs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! I'm not your enemy. You don't need to threaten me. Yes. But it's so much fun to threaten you. I don't get much fun these days. Look, Prisoner X... Zara! 
You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? Oh. No one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. I don't have time for lies, Zara. I need to get out of here. Oh, are we supposed to be friends now? I don't owe you the truth. Or anything for that matter. The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Well, um, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? That's funny. I call him Slimeball, because that's what he is. And a jerk. He has that effect on people. It's true. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person. Except to put the Warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more Warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help Any me? enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. How can I trust you know the way out? Oh, don't worry. I know the way. I'm the only one who does. If you know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. We're all getting out of here. No one's staying behind. Oh, I'm afraid that's quite impossible, Jesse. One of them is going to have to stay. <laughs> oh, I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Hey. 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 Nerm, no, you can't do that. Hey. Oh, come on. We seriously don't have time for this. I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. My straitjacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. I presume? Yeah, guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. What's the matter, friend? <laughs> Nurm here says you wouldn't let him stay, and left Luna in his place instead. <laughs> Nurm, you can't blame yourself, pal. <laughs> we'll come back for her, Nurm. Somehow. Hey. He says he'll take your word for it. For what it's worth, I'm glad you made him come with you. Thank you, Jesse. 
Uh, can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. And his front, and his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. I'm worried about the guy. Whatever happens won't be pretty. Well, beauty is subjective, but... Yeah, not gonna be nice. <laughs> Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! I could take the enchanted iron sword or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad, hmm. Okay, definitely feeling better with the sword in my hand again. Agreed. Versatile. Actually, not a bad look. Looking good, gang. Now let's you jerks go. better not have taken all the cool weapons before I got to dig through them. Friends reunited. It's a prison miracle. Even if Jeff is a little uh, completely different. I ought to pound you to pulp for what you've done to Jeffy Boo. Incoming face punch! Look big, red, and ugly. Maybe you should reconsider your emotions right now. Prisoner X, oh jeez, I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here! Come along, Jeffy! That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? should be just around this corner. We have a situation here. Back! Back! All of you! One more step and it's to Bonesville! Jesse! Hey! You're wearing a guard's outfit! Well, guards ain't in charge no more. And furthermore, I'm not a fan of guards. So thusly, you're getting beat up. A bunch. Oh, boy. Well... Dip my bristles. Look who it is. It's my happy little friend who took a look at my happy little painting. Jesse, you freed Prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore! What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's Prisoner X! I think you've clearly lost your mind. She is bad news. Actually, no, she is way worse than bad news. She doesn't deserve to be locked up. None of us do. Did you know she was once an admin, too? The admin had to take her powers away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that promise. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it! <sighs> Later, Tate. Huh? 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 Why are you all staring at me? It's making me uncomfortable. So is it true what he said about you? You were an admin? Well, ugh, it's complicated. We want answers, Zara. 
Fine! Yes, I was an admin. Ages ago, Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison. But I'm not the villain here. Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here, not me! So glare in another direction! I'm sick of secrets. You should have said something. I assumed you wouldn't take the news well, and how right I was. No more secrets. Fine. No more secrets. There's no way we can trust her now. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we... We don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. I... I'm sorry, Jesse. But do you really trust her? She's not right in the head. Jack, you haven't seen what the admin can do. We need all the help we can get. But her? Really? Petra's right. We need Zara's help. It's the only way. I just hope you're not making a serious mistake getting involved with another admin. Romeo did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Ah, run! Yep. Stay ahead of you. Seriously, what's with these monsters? They're all glowing! They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Let's be scarier. Less talking, more stab! Said, just let me think. Think or make something up. It's fine. Even if there's a setback, we can still get out of this. Not exactly a vote of confidence, but I'll take it. Wait, 
We can just build to the top of the wall. And get to the other side that way. Yeah! Sounds good to me. Wait, where are you going? She ditched us! Guys! Don't come up here! What? Why? my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory. Well, there it is, guys. Our ticket out of here. That is sparkly. The sparkliest. Is that... diamond? <laughs> Where is everyone? That lunatic is gonna be inventory if she's not careful. So? We should lend her a hand, shouldn't we? But she sounds like she's in trouble. We need to worry about ourselves, Petra. We're not abandoning her. I told her I'd help her escape. It's time to prove it. We can't just leave her, come on! Oh, I can't believe we're doing this. Zara, 
come on! You came back. I said I'd get you out, didn't I? Show us the way. I know you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. Let's go. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. I'm not much of a people person anymore. We've all suffered because of the admin. And some have suffered much worse. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. the rest of it? Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the bedrock. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing! And also certain death. They're right, Zara. There's nothing below bedrock. Everyone knows that. Everyone thinks that. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. That's crazy talk. All those monsters... I don't care! She's an admin. An admin killed Boss, then stole his identity, and then... Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. See? I told you! These stairs lead to our salvation! Now there's a good reason to get a move on. anyone run around disguised as me or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is, well, it's unthinkable. That's why I summoned you. Track them down. Make sure they're behaving themselves. Man, oh jeez. Run, 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 Jesse. As fast as you can. 